How's it going, YouTube drinkers? Welcome back. Well, it's your first time. Nice meeting you. I'm Sean, aka the Piping Bruiner. So, for some reason, I didn't know this was a beer. I saw it the other day, and I was like, "Oh, they did a while there." Ale, finally. Um, well, part of this series. No, this has been out since like 2020, and I just didn't know about it for some reason. Or maybe I did and just forgot about it. But uh, this is Sierra Nevada's wild little thing. Part of their little thing. Big thing. Juicy thing series. A slightly slightly sour ale with guava, hibiscus, and strawberry. Coming in at 5.5% alcohol. Um, This was canned all the way back in August. So this is <clears throat> almost the end of January now that I'm doing it. So... About six months of age on it. Seven IBUs. And then I've never had it. I didn't know it existed. So obviously I haven't had it. But um, friends have checked this in 19 times for an overall average of 3.60. Oh. Yeah, 3.60 on untapped out of five. And then this has had over 69,000 checks in totals for an average of 3.52 so take that what you will um, you can't really go off a lot of these ratings on untapped because some people don't really know how to use the app but wild little thing sour ale sour ale with guava hibiscus and strawberry so get into it i've been doing a lot of darker beers um i just went on a little ipa kick for about a week and a half of just like all i drank so it's nice to get something a little bit different something a little more summery springy a little warmer kind of weather a little dgm going on pours like a almost like a red wine um or like a not much of a head even we'll give another swirl about a finger's worth of like a pinkish purple head Ooh, that guava and strawberry come through strong then i just do not just do but i'm trying to think i did I did a beer like this i don't remember what it was but it was strawberry and all that. I'm trying to think. I remember because it came out looking like this. Like, I remember it looking like this. But, yeah. Let's get back to this beer. Yeah, the guava's coming through strong on this one. Um, I do get some of that strawberry. Hibiscus, I've never really been good with the smell of hibiscus. Um... I know the guava and the strawberry are really popping through. Man, it wouldn't be something if I found out that I reviewed this and forgot all about the beer and everything. I would just show how bad it is. Hmm. It has a creamy kind of a texture to it. Smooth and creamy. Like, obviously no lactose in this, but... get like almost a creamy vanilla and mixes in with that strawberry and guava really good and I don't know why because there's no lactose in this mm, got a little bit of hibiscus on the sip this is an all right a little sour not very tart like you know and maybe because it's with the age on it, but like, this is a decent little 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 sh 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 little wild thing, little little sour, you know. This is that good intro, gets you into sours and tarts and all that fun stuff. That's what this is, you know. Yeah, if you're, if you're looking to get into sours or starting to make that change, this is a good one for that. Very light. Like I said, not really tart. Strawberry, the guava mixed together, and there's like a creaminess to it. 
Yeah, 3.75. Like, it's a good beginning, a little sour. A little wild thing. It's not, it's not bad. Maybe a little bit fresher. It might have some more of that tartness that you're looking for. But, um, yeah, I think this would be a good sit out back on the, on your deck. You know, springtime in the summer. Everything's really starting to come alive, get green, trees are budding. <clears throat> this is that good spring in the summertime, back porch. Um, maybe you're just firing up your grill. You want to start with something a little more light. Yeah. Yeah, this is... This would be good. Buy up the grill. Get something fruity in to start the day. Before you start breaking out, you know, the, you know, the, the loggers and the ambers. Or like a good in-between. You could start with that and then <clears throat> you want something that's a little look on the palate. You just want to sit down and kind of stare out in the flowers and the woods and the nature. That's this right here. 3.75 all day. Sierra Nevada. This is probably out of their North Carolina facility because I'm on the East Coast. Yeah, what's going on with that? But not bad, not bad. Thank you for watching. Until next time, cheers.